Hi everybody and welcome back. Okay, so last time you seen me, it was an empty house tour. It is now a couple of months later and actually a good few months later. And I'm now married uh, and we've lived in here for about a month and a half. So let me show you about my nearly complete house tour. Okay, like last time, this is our front door. Right, so this is really cute. This doormat is a Disney doormat. It's from Up. It's Welcome to Paradise. As you can see, it's starting to fade, which I'm really sad about, but uh, it's really cute. So I changed the curtains to these little curtains from Danelm. And uh, yeah, they're just like leafy greens. I painted, I didn't. I had someone paint uh, the walls a green color also and then sorry it's a bit of a mess here i have a key holder here and my keys a bt box and stuff like that not bt i have my internet box and uh, then a little duck that says welcome in here is the bathroom so we've done like a beachy thing so let me switch the light on we have just this lampshade up here and then this is a Jules towel and the sink is the same. A, probably all the accessories is from like the range home bargains, all that. A, toilet's the same. A, all of this sort of stuff, the nautical theme stuff is from the range. And then we have this mirror from Donnell, just like a porthole mirror. And it's super cute. Then we come out. I still have the same herringbone floor through. I didn't change that floor. Uh, this is William's office. This is one of the rooms that isn't done. Let me switch on the light. So in here we have a couch. Um, boxes that aren't unpacked yet. And that is PPE for my work. He has just his gaming setup and all of that stuff up there. His shelf. And yep, yeah, that's that. Then we have our living room. So we have these uh, check work uh, curtains. My aunt got us, they're from Dunelm. And we got these couches, a three and a two. So yeah, it shows you what you can actually kind of fit in now. So we kept the fireplace, as I said, I did want a stove, however, I love the fireplace, didn't want to rip that out. We have mounted the TV and on here we have like this cute little dog, candle and a photograph from our wedding day. This uh, is from the range, this sideboard and have this lovely lamp. We stag, picture of my two dogs. Um, a fancy candle, that's a Cote I know our candle, smells beautiful these fake uh, flowers. And then over here is like gym stuff. So it's like a barbell, a bench. And then how cute is this little um, dog chair? This uh, extension is just from the TV. Then on our fireplace, I have decorated, decorated with this little dog, super cute. And then just that, this is Holly's dog bed. So it is with her blanket and her toys. Then we have just some sticks for whenever we have fire, the fire lit. Um, so as you can see, I kind of like animals. So I have like a little bunny, uh, a bunny on my couch and a hedgehog on this couch. And then over here, um, this is my handbag, a picture of William and I. I think that was our first year going out. It's really cute. Then um, this is just a photo album, a dog whistle and accessories this is my uh dining room so i have this uh, uh what do you call that mirror from the range and then this seat is from Donnell. the pillow is a disney pillow it's from up and it says home is where the adventure is this is holly's bed for whenever we're not here and then up there is actually christmas presents the dining table um yeah, it's just got stuff on it. And over here, I'm getting ready for Christmas. So pile of Christmas stuff. But this is my desk. This is where I do like my paperwork. And there's some more photos of our wedding. A picture of Holly. You know, this cute uh, picture of Central Park. 
um, it's from the range. Then this dresser was actually Williams. It's ma It was mahogany, but we painted it. And up here I have an up cookie jar. Another picture of our wedding. Sorry, that is dog uh, hair spray thing. Uh, some decorative stuff and dog things. These are my favorite little Balik uh, mugs and a teapot that I got for a wedding gift. And then in there is just a wee picture of a lighthouse from a place in Donegal we stayed at. Not, we didn't stay at the lighthouse, we went to visit the lighthouse. And then you come through here into our kitchen. Now, the change in the kitchen is, let me turn on the light, we changed the floor. So if you remember from last time, I, we had some horrible tiles that I hated. Uh, so yeah, we changed the floor to this gray herringbone. Love it. Uh, obviously we have all our appliances now so we had we did have a slimline dishwasher that the previous occupants left however uh, it needed replaced so there's this new one and then we got our washer dryer and yeah so that's just our cabinets and yeah double fridge always wanted one in a home of my own with the ice and the water I have the microwave, cookie, cookery books are up there. Um, my aunt bought us this KitchenAid. It is beautiful. So yeah, um, these are actually meant to be over here. It's just a salt and pepper shaker that came from Houston's. Shall I go through my cupboards? Right, forgive me if they're messy. So this one is the undersink one. It looks an absolute mess. And unfortunately it's gonna stay like that. This one is our plates. So we have on the top row is all everyday plates. Bottom row is my Balik Ever uh, fancy sets. And then up here, we have our glassware, a good bit of it. So we have, these are the ones we mainly use. And then up here I have Galway crystal. And yeah, so these are my fancy mugs that William isn't allowed to touch. They are I can't even remember where they're from, but they're really cute and he's not allowed to touch them. Up here is our mugs and a tea set. This is just like cooking stuff and like stuff I don't need is all up there. And then like Tupperware boxes and Parix uh, baking dishes and stuff like that in there. This is just where all that stuff stays. In here is where like our chip pan is, our uh, uh, crock pot and all that stuff. And this is my baking cupboard, which is a tip and needs organized. Now you may be thinking, where's your food? Well, we turned this into our pantry. Well, basically our pantry. So William shelved up here. He did this all by himself. So uh, we have our canned goods up here. Then we have like baking ingredients and like rices, pastas and stuff and like jars stuff down there. That's our junk pile of stuff. Potatoes and more junk stuff. And then just like a mop bucket and stuff over there. So that's where we left that. So it kind of looks really disorganized in there, but it actually is organized. Just messily organized, unfortunately. Um, I got Holly's cute dish from uh, Home Sense, so I did. This is our outside. Nothing has really changed out here, except we got a uh, chairs and table, a dog box for when Holly's outside, and um, a storage container. So that is it. Okay, so coming back out through the kitchen, our lamp, not lamp, our light shade is beautiful. They both came from the range. They were 90 pound each, but I think they were so worth it. And then the next thing we changed was the stair carpet. I really loved the stair carpet. However, it was really, really dirty. So I got this like, beautiful gray and I don't know what that pattern is but lovely anyway my grandparents give us some money for our wedding and I put it towards the carpet so upstairs we go near sale 
Okay, so straight away on our left, it's William and, our William and my bedroom. So I have my makeup desk, of course. This we didn't think was going to fit this room. is kind of small, but yeah. So I'll show you in my makeup desk. We have kind of everyday stuff. Blushers, bronzers, uh, highlighters, and uh, what do you call these? Powders. Then we have eyeshadows. Hair stuff. More hair stuff. Sorry, this is my like go-to everyday rich stuff. So skincare, foundations, concealers, other foundations, and primers. Then we have lipsticks, eyelashes, eyebrow stuff. And I've went through all this and got rid of a pile. Primer and stuff, uh, eyeliners and mascaras. Sorry, I'm all out of breath. Skincare. And I think this is just uh, refills. Then, as you know, we have our um, built-in. So, this is my site. So, I have here just all my hanging clothes, all my folded clothes up there. Um, these are like work trousers and leggings and then perfumes. And then this is just like purses. Pajama socks in there. We just have Christmas candles here. Gym stuff. Underwear. Underwear. Socks. And PJs fill to the brim. And then William's side, I haven't been in here, so I don't know what this is like, is that. He got his drawers from Ikea. I think they're the Malm drawers. And I was very like, I didn't want a bed. No, it's not a bed. I was very like, I didn't want a TV in the bedroom. However, William really likes having a TV in the bedroom. If you guys know, I haven't had a TV in my room since I was like young. So I compromised and I got a TV bed and it is pretty cool. So this is our bed. It's just a standard double. Uh, my Jill's bed clothes are really cute. My mum got us them for Christmas last year. That's William's side. My side is a little bit more cluttered. But it has everything I normally keep. Um, my wedding ring here. Another fancy candle. It's a Cote Noir one. And it smells divine. Picture of Holly and I. I'll show you. The TV comes out of here. I'm sure everybody's seen a TV bed before. But they're pretty cool. So I think William leaves it in this drawer. And then you just go like. Boosh. With the remote. And up pops your TV. I have to admit that is really cool. I hope you agree. Um, it's a 32 inch, I think, JCB TV. It's a smart TV. Just the job. His lovely parents bought us that for our wedding. Um, the bed I got from Very. So I did um, my bed because we have sloped ceilings. Uh, sorry, let me just close that. My bed, we didn't bring. However, because we have sloped ceilings, we have a little gap here. My bed would have came up to here, so it would have been a bigger gap. And also, we wouldn't have been able to fit two bedside cabinets. And I like having a bedside cabinet, so we have one on each side. This bed just did the job. And this mat is from Amazon. It's just a fluffy mat. I think it was like 20-something pound. And then we got this fluffy cloud lampshade from... Home base and it's really cool next you just walk straight through in here is our hot press so uh, it's filled with blankets and not blank well we have two blankets and the rest is towels face cloths and all that we have some toilet roll quite a bit laundry basket i have one of my suitcases some christmas stuff in here and then this is one of my favorites it, this is actually my cleaning cupboard basically so my hoover lives in here so i have just this shark hoover the pet one and it's just battery powered so i have my cleaning stuff in here then i have like william stuff my stuff uh shared stuff uh shampoo you may be like rachel where's all the cleaning stuff it's down here uh so we have deodorant i have a lot i don't need any more uh, then we start like our laundry stuff, backups and toilet, and not toilet rolls, what do you call it, uh, kitchen roll and more cleaning stuff here. And then, you know, more stuff here. 
And then them boxes are also full. I kind of went a wee bit OTT when I got the keys to the house. And yeah. This is our bathroom. A little bit cute. So apologies for the yellow light. We have a little skylight here, which is really cute. A uh, toilet, bath. As you can tell, I still have that nautical theme here. So all the stuff is from the range. Shower. And uh, I really hate this mirror, but it's kind of bolted to the tie. So to get it off, I think I would have to get rid of the tie, which can't afford at the minute. So we have that and then sink. And then we got this under sink storage thing, which just holds shampoos and conditioners and stuff. And then we have our towel reel, which is awesome. So it is absolutely awesome. And just our dressing gowns. And then this room is a mess. So apologies. We haven't unpacked everything and then our Christmas decorations are in here at the minute. But this is our spare room. So as you can see, it fits a double. This is an ottoman bed. So underneath is where the Christmas tree and all is at the minute. So it's a good size room. So it is, you, as you can see, you can fit the double. Bedside cabinet. Uh, we have a dresser here in this alcove. This alcove has just junk. Then my original dressing table. This cute little mirror, some Disney ears. It has a Disney theme, if you can't tell. So, like, there's the castle, Walt Disney and Mickey Mouse, Epcot. There's my family and I at the castle. This cute arcade machine. My first ever lounge fly, which is little aliens. The chip the teacup. Then we have Animal Kingdom here. And uh, another little up house. And then Lilo and Stitch ring uh, jewellery thing. And then I have a pile of these books also. But then, as I say, slope ceiling. So we have our skylight there. And then that's our bed. So it does have like a good bit of floor space. Yeah. So whenever it comes to having kids or having guests, we have room for them. Okay, so that is basically my house. I'm not going to show you out the front of my house because privacy reasons, but put it this way, our little house is so perfect. We live in a small cul-de-sac and yeah, it's just perfect. It's quiet, it's brilliant. We have a good bit of sunlight throughout the day and it's just awesome. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope this video wasn't too rushed and I'll see you guys in the next video, bye.